Hello, my name is Onyi Iwala, and I'm an assistant professor at the University of North Carolina in Chapel Hill. I'm a member of the UNC Food Allergy Initiative, and I direct our Allergy Mast Cell Disorders Program. And here are a few points that I wish providers knew about alpha-gal syndrome. So if you or your patients have alpha-gal syndrome, remind yourself and remind your patients about the hidden sources of alpha-gal in our diets. These include bacon and fat back in vegetable dishes, pork encasing poultry sausages, beef broths in soups, gravy drippings, cooking lard, gelatin, which in the US is made from mammals. Number two, if you or your patients have both active alpha-gal syndrome and a mast cell disorder like systemic mastocytosis or mast cell activation syndrome, then you should remind yourself and encourage your patients to carry their epinephrine auto-injectors or their epinasal sprays in case they have an accidental ingestion of alpha-gal that results in a serious allergic reaction. Because patients dealing with both alpha-gal syndrome and a mast cell disorder are more likely to have more severe reactions. But these reactions are 100% treatable. You just need to have the right medications on hand, and epinephrine is one of those medications. Number three, patients with alpha-gal syndrome can be vaccinated, particularly when it comes to flu and COVID vaccines, or even the latest RSV vaccines. There are several options out there that are mammal-free and generally well-tolerated by patients without and with alpha-gal syndrome. And finally, drug package inserts are your friends. A quick Google search of the drug name and the phrase package insert will pull up the information about the medication, including its active and inactive ingredients. Drug manufacturers are required to provide these inserts and make them readily available to the public. So if you look at these FDA package inserts under section number 11, you can look up whether there are any obvious components that are derived from mammals, like gelatin, for example. Thanks a lot and hope you enjoy the rest of the meeting. Take care.